Did you know that spiders, those ancient architects that have roamed the earth for over 200 million years, are master weavers of intricate webs for a multitude of purposes? They create a diverse array of web types, including spiral orb webs, woolly formations, tangled structures, sheet-like designs, funnel-shaped constructs, and much more. Surprisingly, the use of their silk extends far beyond mere web construction. Spiders employ their silk for hunting, securing prey, engaging in mating rituals, facilitating transportation, safeguarding their eggs, and even hiding from potential predators. Intriguingly, not all spiders are web builders. Some utilize their silk for constructing trap doors, complete with hinges, to conceal themselves and then strategically pounce on unsuspecting prey. Additionally, spiders may fashion silken tunnels scaling the sides of trees. The versatility of spider silk is truly remarkable. Despite being thinner than a human hair, each strand boasts a pound-for-pound -pound tensile strength greater than many varieties of steel. Let's delve into the composition of spider silk. While spiders can produce various silk types, the most versatile is dragline silk. This organic material is crafted from a protein known as speed drying, predominantly composed of alanine and glycine. Produced within a spider's silk glands, these proteins start as a thick paste and are meticulously drawn out into fibers as a spider spins its web. The strength of spider silk lies in the intricate arrangement of proteins within a strand. Millions upon millions of protein molecules align tightly in what is referred to as a beta sheet, adding to its strength. Each beta sheet is surrounded by crystalline regions. The complexity doesn't stop there. Each strand of silk is comprised of thousands of nano strands that work together seamlessly. The collaborative effort of these protein molecules is truly astonishing, requiring considerable force to break a strand. In the realm of physics, this is expressed as force applied over a certain distance, highlighting the extraordinary tensile strength of spider silk. Scientists have even speculated that reproducing dragline silk to the staggering length of 18.6 miles and as thick as a pencil could yield a material strong enough to intercept a plane mid-flight. The Darwin's Bark Spider, discovered in 2010, has silk that stands out for its exceptional strength. Tests revealed that silk from this spider is over twice as tough as that from any other spider species and more than 10 times tougher than Kevlar. Darwin's bark spiders are known for creating some of the largest webs in nature, spanning up to 30 square feet. Some individuals even spin webs long enough to serve as bridges over small bodies of water. Despite the incredible strength of spider silk, the challenge has been replicating it artificially. Researchers at Cambridge University, however, have come close by developing a process using hydrogel a compound consisting of 98% water and 2% silica and cellulose. This innovative material, held together by molecules called cucurbitrols, avoids environmentally harmful solvents and can be produced at room temperature. As we continue to uncover the mysteries of spiders, who have been weaving their tails for millions of years, there remains much to learn from these nature-inspired engineers. While the prospect of a synthetic material surpassing cotton in popularity looms, the intricate world of spider silk stands as a testament to the brilliance of natural design. In summary, spiders, ancient architects with a history spanning over 200 million years, are master weavers, creating diverse webs for hunting, mating, and more. Their silk, notably dragline silk, is a complex composition of proteins like speed drying, rich in alanine and glycine. The strength lies in tight protein arrangement forming beta sheets surrounded by crystalline regions. Each strand, consisting of nano strands, exhibits extraordinary tensile strength, surpassing steel pound for pound. Darwin's bark spider, with silk over twice as tough as any other, inspired interest. Its silk, known for creating large webs and even bridges, poses challenges in artificial replication. Cambridge University's breakthrough uses hydrogel, composed mostly of water, silica, and cellulose, held together by cucurbitrols, offering an eco-friendly alternative to synthetic silk production at room temperature. As we unlock the secrets of spider silk, its potential applications are vast. The prospect of a synthetic material rivaling cotton gains momentum, showcasing the brilliance of natural design.
In our ongoing exploration of these nature-inspired engineers, there is much more to uncover and learn.